Hey everybody, this is Ryan. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Terraria! And so, okay, so I've been busy. Um, oh look, I have a house. Oh my god, there's a goblin. And um, uh, I built some things. But first, we are going to make some mod things. Because we haven't made that many mod things yet. And what are we going to make? Well, there's two things I really got my eye on. First, I need a... Um, I, don't, I don't need to be over here. What are you doing over here? This is completely wrong. Um... First, I need to figure out where I need to go to make it. <laughs> Alright, so I got this boomstick from the jungle. And, if you combine it with, well, in my case, platinum and a flare gun, you get a firestorm cannon. And I'm pretty intrigued on what exactly this looks like. So there's my platinum. Everything else should already be in my inventory. There you go, Firestorm Cannon. Ha boom. Okay. Um, so it actually does less damage than a normal flare gun, but it's a it's a machine flare gun. It's about what I figured. Okay. So that's probably not as cool as I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> it is a mat another material though. So one thing I love about this mod is everything is a material. So it gets upgraded into a it looks like a, a flare minigun. That's a hard mode stuff though. That's that's like end game stuff. Those are vo vortex fragments. Okay. Well, we're not gonna be making that probably ever because I'll forget about it. The other thing I wanted to make is I can make a whole bunch of stuff with um, not these actually these bars. I can't hardly make anything with these bars. Uh, because I need, like, sandstone or sun sunstone is what I need. And um, I can't do any of that yet. But there was another thing I had my eye on, and it involved this guy. And that is this, a storm surge. It does not consume ammo, and it says fear the storm. The fact that it doesn't consume ammo makes me think this is actually pretty weak. Because that would be really overpowered to have average knockback, fast speed, pretty good damage. And, um... To not consume ammo, that seems really powerful. And we just need to be at an anvil, and we should have every... No, we don't. Good now, there we go. Storm Surge! I needed a, a Storm Lion Mantable and, and some other things. What? What the fuck? And this doesn't consume ammo? We gotta see this thing in action. Is this as powerful as I want it to be? Took out that blink root pretty hard. I mean, that's pretty powerful to have knockback. A ranged weapon that has knockback. I was gonna say this shoots through stuff, but no, it doesn't. Does not have auto fire. But that's still, that's still pretty powerful. I mean, look at that. These guys are a pain in the ass to fight. Man, his body really flew apart there, didn't it? I am a fan of this. Uh, most definitely. More than the space gun. I really like that murderous space gun. But I'm really feeling uh, this gun. That's a halfway decent uh, prefix on it, too. How much are you to reforge? I'm going to say you're really expensive. You should be. You're super cheap. You're stupidly cheap. I will take a godly version. I think so. I think that'll do the trick. Um, what else do I need to do? Oh, there's, so there's another boss floating around. Um, I'm not super prepared for him. It looks like I'm out of swiftness potions. Okay, okay, yeah, you're, you're cool. Nobody can see you, isn't that fun? Nobody can see you and you just hit me. So I'm pretty sure we're supposed to go to the ocean. I don't know about next, but that's definitely one of the top things that we need to do. 
But, remember that thing that I, I poked around at last time and then it killed me? Well, okay, here's the thing. It moves. I swear to God, guys, it moves around the map. I assume that there are multiple of them. But I keep finding it all over the damn place. Found it out here in the desert last time. Alright, so we are over here on the far right side of the map. You can see I'm all the way over here. And so I was coming over here to get some corals and stuff for all those Victide bars. And that was the most recent time I saw this thing, so I wonder if it's still here. I don't know what kind of timer it has before it ups and, and respawns itself somewhere else. Oh, come on. Just be here. You were just here! There it is. Okay, I don't really know what it's... It is, okay, it's like spitting things out. Okay. Yeah, if we could get you up to the surface. You do a lot of damage, though. I'll give you that. Okay. Hmm. If I could have him in an actual arena, um, that would not be bad. Oh, look. There's one literally in my arena. Okay. Well, now I really need to kill him or I'm going to look stupid. And I see why an arena is cheesing you pretty hard. I see that now. Okay, you're actually pretty hard. <laughs> like, I am cheesing the hell out of this fight. No, I don't want to I don't want to be on that level. I don't want to do that. No. No, you can't suddenly figure out how to kill me. No! Damn it to hell. He was so close. Okay, that fight was actually so much harder than I thought it was going to be. Huh. All right. So I made another world so I can fight a eater of worlds and get his expert item. And as, I, as, I, as, I, as I'm running across the map, I found a pyramid. So naturally, I'm going to go see what is in it because, well, there's no rules against that. If you make a world for legitimate purposes, you get all things in said world, including pyramids. I gotta say, before hard mode, I never used the space gun and meteorite armor set for anything. And now that hard mode is here, it's amazing. Or expert mode. I always call it hard mode. Obviously, it's expert mode. There you go. Combine it with a bloody warm worm tooth, which I, um... Obviously don't have But wow super powerful Okay, now that we have that I basically came straight here because I am going to fight him uh, Killed me some Skeletron so I can get into that dungeon so I can get the shield so I can stop having knockback very much looking forward to that Okay, well, this is just going swell. All right, and another fun thing that I need to do is uh, find me a lucky horseshoe or some balloons. I would love to have some balloons. Uh, yeah, increase my jumping power. But um, you can get wings, too. You can get wings pretty early in this. All you need is feathers, so... We're going to check this out. Yeah, 
That, uh, that kind of came out of nowhere. <laughs> I think I looked away or something. I don't know what the hell that was. Well then. Where am I going? Okay, man, look how far I made it! That was it. That was the game's fault. It put me into a, a sense of sleep <laughs> and boredom. Shouldn't have to go that far to find the first floating island. Stupid game. I think you're funny, huh? I think you're funny, huh? But I shoot you in the face with a stupid dog! Yeah! And what do we get behind door number one? A balloon. Okay. Acceptable. Door number two? A crappy sword. There's a material. I think I've already seen the material that that turns into. And... Eh. Spoiler, I think it's a sword. Knocky oh. shoe! There we go. There we go. There we go. It's all better now. Everything is gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay. We have our lucky horseshoe. I am a huge fan of the lucky horseshoe. But with getting wings so early, that kind of makes the lucky horseshoe kind of be relevant, I guess. All right, I feel like 10 is a good number. Let's see if we can make anything. Make stuff? Make stuff with 10? Did I did I leave them on the cloud? There we go. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I don't know if I have five stars. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The perfect number of stars. Skylight wings. They're so pretty. So unfortunately for the horseshoe that I was excited about, um, yeah, okay. <laughs> I was just waiting for it to kill me. I was like, nope, still need the horseshoe. No, we're good. Uh, yeah, I don't need it anymore. Okay, so I stand a little bit corrected about the the Star Fury and the sword that it transforms into. I was wrong. Apparently, it is exceptionally crazy balls powerful. Okay, so my mistake. <laughs> the sword that I was like, eh, it's kind of lame. Apparently, it's not. Okay, so, so yeah, <laughs> I, was, I got my swords mixed up. I was thinking of a different sword. Alright, so I had wanted to uh, get this finished up a little bit more before it uh, turned uh, time tonight. But, um, either way, uh, it didn't happen, so we're going to try to kill Skeletron. And this fight's pretty hard in hard mode. It is. It's a hard fight. Not to mention he gets a freaking cheap shot on you. Stay away from me. Haha, <laughs> you didn't get the cheap shot on me. Screw you, jerk. Alright, so almost no more Skeletron! Almost no more Skeletron! No more Skeletron! No more Skeletron! Still Skeletron. Come on, let's do this. Let's do this, Skeletron. Come on. Apparently I misread the number when I started talking. But no, we're gonna keep- we're gonna keep it going! We're gonna keep it going, Skeletron! Almost. Oh god, he's so close! Skelet- Skeletron? Skeletron? No, no. Yeah, there we go. There we go, Skeletron. All right, so here's the uh, the normal stuff, the normal stuff that I really don't care about. The only thing that I care about at all in this whole place is the magic shield. So I'm gonna run through here, hopefully find uh, some decent normal dungeon items, and I will jump in if anything mod related happens. I don't know if anything uh, mod related will happen. 
We'll find out. Those guys are pretty normal. Um, enemies release a blue aura cloud on death. It's a, it's a material. It does okay damage. I imagine it's very little. Yeah, it's very little. So what does the cloud do? Does it like heal me or something? Because that would be kind of cool. Um, no, it just kind of sits there. I mean, that's cool too. Not really doing anything is, is really cool too. Toyed another thing I said wrong. When I first got this gun, I initially thought that you could shoot through walls. And then I was like, oh no, you can't. Well, good, because that would be really overpowered if you could. Oh no, you can. You can shoot through walls. Absolutely. There's my shield. Beautiful. Okay, so now I can leave this horrible place. Uh, nothing really happened. I killed a lot of things. I got a bunch of banners that I probably won't ever even put up. And, um... Yeah. That's it. <laughs> Got a lot of stuff, and I probably won't use it. I did make a lot of money, though. Because money is super valuable, and it's so hard to come by. This is the one place you have to go to make money. Glad that worked out. So I just killed a, a big something slime, and I got some gel for it. So, that's just a, a minor note. Sorry for the interruption of the uh, fast forwarding through stuff. That is just a minor note that I got some gels. So I figured I would end this video just like I began it by dying to this jerk. We're gonna ancient shiv this guy. I forgot to look up what this makes. Um, if I remember, which I won't, we'll, uh, we'll do it at the end of the video. Alright. Alright, you jerk. No, I don't need you. I don't need you. You can be a spectator. That's fine. Stand on the sidelines and watch. But I don't need you here. Those are the slimes that give you gel. They give you like blighted gel or something. Okay, so that was the medium one. So that would imply that there's a long one. <laughs> So these gels are showing up like crazy now that I killed Skeletron. I don't know, it could just be uh, they show up, or they just didn't show up, or now they show up now that Skeletron's dead. I don't know. Okay, you're bigger. You are bigger. But he's almost dead. Okay, so he's dead. So that's the thing that happened. We killed him, but now we gotta, I think we should go ahead and kill this asshole. Because, well, he's here. You're, you're kinda, you're kinda cool looking. You kinda like the look you got going on, Wormy. I liked you a lot more when you were down a level lower, so let's try to get that that going again. Yeah, yeah, down here isn't it nicer down here? It's, it's a much better view of the the red rocks, and um, I don't know your friends that are down there. You can see them really well. You can really see those guys. Champion me! There's a lot of stuff to pick up right here as well.
Oh, glorious day! Oh, we got so many things! Alright, first let's open the treasure bag. We got a bloody worm tooth. That is a thing! That is a thing that I didn't know what it did. And it combines with something. Alright, so this does 7% increased damage reduction and increased melee stats. 14% increased damage reduction and melee stats from below 50% life. That is uh, pretty damn nice. I am excited to have that. I am, however, very confused on where my uh, worm scarf went. Okay, so it appears that I have misplaced my uh, worm scarf. You son of a bitch! <laughs> what the hell? No! No, not okay! Man, they had to come a long ways to get me. Anyway, um, I, I have misplaced my worm scarf, which uh, is a bummer. I'll have to go get another one now. But this combines with that, so I'll show you what it combines to. I think I might have showed it before I don't remember but I had no idea how to get a bloody worm tooth but here you go and 15% uh, damage reduction and increased melee stats so basically it just combines the two uh, when these both seem really damn good so I am very excited to do that I got some blood samples this was a material I was wondering how to get this does things as well oh my god I got so much to craft I mean look at this stuff this stuff is pretty powerful bloody worm food But yeah, some halfway decent weapons here. Uh, some of this stuff looks pretty good. Check out the ancient shiv really quick. Oh, wow. So I need the ancient shiv, the bloody rupture, which I just got. Um, a flame burst short sword. I don't know where to get that yet. I don't know where to get the spore knife. Um, I mean, it just seems pretty obvious. Some of those are hell related. Some of those are jungle related. Some of those. There's only two other things, man. Come on. Yeah, they, that's where you get them. Somewhere in there. I don't know. We will learn and find out, and it'll be amazing. And then we get the next stabber. Stab, 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 stab. Uh, don't underestimate the power of stabby knives. I, I, okay. Sure. Sure. Um, yeah, that's, that's a thing. And uh, it does decent damage. It's a material, which is the main thing. Very fast speed. Blah, 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 blah. Normal things. And, um... Anything else exciting we got from that? I mean, that stuff is exciting, but is there anything else that is exciting? I don't think so. What a productive episode. I killed so many things. Oh my God, I'm killing everything. Kill. Like this, like this rabbit. See this rabbit? Oh, well. See, he, he jumped. He jumped down to try to kill himself, and now he's going to drown because he's like, that guy, that guy is a straight up killing machine. I can't handle what he's bringing. So I'm just going to kill myself. I'm going to do him a courtesy and just go ahead and jump off this ledge. And I appreciate that, Mr. Rabbit, but I will probably kill your family in the future. So, what are you going to do? All right, that is going to do it! Thank you so much for watching, everybody. We are doing my things, and oh my god, there's so many of my things to do. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, see you guys.